guys, I'm Lou and welcome to Lou's Green Life. But before I go on to the main topic, please support the YouTube channel of King Salam Tagyan. He is my professor. And um, like, subscribe, feel free to comment down below, and please spread the word. The main objective of his content was to help the people, especially the poor and less privileged, by giving them program. Uh, which is Land for the Landless, Green Revolution, and Barangay Chambers of Commerce and Services. A tangible, unique, beyond compare project of the King for the benefit of majority and also to uplift the living standard, the economics of the Republic of the Philippines, as well as the Makarlika Kingdom. I'll put the link on the description down below so that you can check that out. So without further ado, let's get started. Hello guys, I'm Lou and welcome to Lou's Green Life. So I'm here at the um, Lady's Finger Plantation of Mr. San Andres. So sir, thank you for allowing me and giving me the opportunity to make this video happen. So guys, this is Mr. San Andres and he happens to be the owner of the Lady's Finger Plantation. So sir, um, bakit sir um, Lady's Finger ang mas prefer mong itanin unlike doon sa ibang paninin? Kasi mas madaling itanim at madaling uh, patok sa mga tao at mabay kami. Mm. At so, ilang sir? Pindoto. Mm. So, sir, ilang taon na po kayo nagtatanim ng ladies finger? Siguro mga 5 years. Tama. Okay. So, guys, 5 years na si Mr. San Andres nagtatanim ng um, ladies finger. So, aside for its health benefits, um, it isa rin yan sa mga main statement ay isa rin yan sa mga dahilan ni Mr. San Andres so without further ado let's dive in so guys the latest finger is a multi-purpose crop valued for its tender and delicious pods in West Africa um, the seeds the flowers and the pods are also consumed and the dried seeds provides oil, vegetable curd, and a coffee additive or substitute. And for today's video guys, I'm going to discuss the latest finger or its scientific name, Abel Mostius Escalentus Lin. So let's commence. So guys, what is the latest finger? So the latest finger is an annual erect, stout steamed bristly herbs. Um, that grows to a height of about 2 meters high. And as you can see, the leaves are angular, long stalked, and coarsely toothed. And the single flower, the single, the single flower is located in the axils of the leaves, which is pale yellow in color. And the latest finger is slimy when cut for cooking, and it is grown in tropical and subtropical countries. Guys, the latest finger was native to the tropics of the Eastern Hemisphere and is widely naturalized in the tropics and subtropics of the Western Hemisphere. Guys, remember because only the unripe and tender fruit is eaten as a vegetable. And the latest finger may be prepared like asparagus, sauteed, or pickled. And it is also um, an ingredient for various stews. And in the gumbas of the southern United States, the large amount of mucilage in it contains makes it useful as a thickener for broths and soups. And in some countries, the dried seeds are used as a coffee substitute. So guys, what is the medicinal use of the latest finger? Surprisingly, it has six amazing medicinal use. What are those? Number one, it helps to soothe 
and protects the elementary tracts. And number two, um, it acts as a softener for inflamed parts. Number three, it is also helps to relieve flatulence and gripping pains from the stomach and bowels. And number four, it is also helps to prevent or cure spasm. Number five, it is a laxative. And number six, it is also helps to control pneumonia, bronchitis, urinary problems, heart disease, and tuberculosis of the lungs. Guys, how to use this plant when it comes to treatment? Well, the leaves is highly recommended as a poultice. Also in decoction in cases of um, pneumonia and bronchitis. And for the same disease, a tea from the flowers and the leaves is prepared by decoction, which is taken internally with a little bit honey. Number two, the roots and decoction is recommended um, for inflamed mucous membrane of the urethra and vagina, infections, venereal diseases, and other genital problems. Number three, the seeds are used for heart disease. They are roasted and prepared as a tea, and four to five glasses are to be taken per day. Lastly, number four, the unripe fruit is used for pulmonary tuberculosis. And guys, remember when eating too much of ladies' finger because eating too much ladies' finger can adversely affect some people with gastrointestinal problems. And the ladies' finger contains fructans. So a fructans is a type of carbohydrates. And the fructans can cause diarrhea, gas, cramping, and bloating in people with existing bowel problems. And the lady's finger is high in oxalates. Guys, how to take care of the lady's finger? I have one big tip that you should and must remember. All you have to do is to improve native soil by mixing several inches of aged compost or other rich organic matters. And the lady's finger loves the heat and can withstand a dry spell. But guys, um, um, do your best to give them um, one inch of water every week just to maintain its growth. And you can harvest the latest finger when they are two to four inches long. That's all for today's guys. I hope you learned a little. And if you like this video, please like, subscribe. Feel free to comment down below if you want answers, suggestions, or opinions regarding on my current video. And that's all for today. I hope all is well with you and your family. And good luck in the garden. Keep in touch.